Hello everyone, so even though I missed the demo for this game, I can still play it courtesy of the developer. This is Dimensionals, let's see what it is all about. Okay, so this cutscene right here actually reminds me a bit of Final Space with the art, which is only good because Final Space was awesome, so let's hope that this game is also pretty awesome. So, um... If you do like the video, of course, subscribe at the end, comment down below if you play this game and if you want to play. This is a roguelike card game. Okay, so the Grams told me how to fight. I apparently have to drag my skills to my opponents to kill them, which uh, sounds a bit rough, but uh, <laughs> let's do it. I have Whale, I have Numbing Zap with my little robot pal. AI has come a long way indeed if you can zap your enemies around. And Gramps is basically just a shield dude. Okay, so I'm guessing that the enemy will attack Gramps for five, but will not do anything because Gramps is um, taking his uh, immune p system pills and <laughs> suffers no damage. And the zap, and now he will suffer even less damage. That's pretty good. So. I think I'll win. This is of course the prologue which serves as tutorial, so if I lose this I may as well uh, delete my channel because this is really easy. So we won, let's see what happens after we win. I got this little chest and I can decide what to take. So I have barrier which is shield, another whale. I do know if you combine two of the same it's a little bit better but I'll go with whack them all here because Destroying every enemy is uh, pretty good, and if I kill it with this one, then uh, it refreshes. I can use it one more time. I'll give it to Boop Boop. Mr. Boop here. Needs a little bit of help, and then I have a strike, which I will give to Koa. That's a name right there. Okay, we won the first one. Yay! Okay, so now she is being very, very unhappy uh, because we have the dimensions opened and apparently this is not good at all. And the specters, they have never been this organized before. Of course they weren't because otherwise we wouldn't have any game. Okay, you got it, boss. I guess so basically, oh. Uh, hello. A giant talking rat is on our ship because we have to have a shopkeeper and if it's not a rat, is it even a shopkeeper? Nope. No, it's not. Nice coin flipping there. Okay, let's see what we can do with the shopkeeper who is not throwing away money. I hope I can get some coins out of it. Okay, so he's selling cards and... Uh, the scales pretty much. I mean, Bolden. I don't want any of those. No, not this. I, I want some like offensive skill which has defense too. And here it is protective strike. You know what? It's pretty good. I'll take this one and uh, we'll go with this. Uh, I'll give it to Gramps because he's the defense specialist around here. And he'll help us with that. So now I'm fighting a hunter which has a little bit of a gimmick. If he hits you and damages you, he heals. Which of course will not happen this time around because... Let's see, he does 12 damage to Gramps right now. He has 10 already. Uh, oh, that, <laughs> that was a slight mistake here because I could go with the weakening strike from Boop. So we would damage him, but it's fine. Uh, he's gonna shield himself up next turn anyway, so who cares. Okay, uh, protective strike is not needed here. Uh, I can just wail on him, I guess, or strike him. Try to do critical, and I'll do this, even though this is a mistake right now. But I'll do this just to demonstrate how uh, it works now, his little shield he would do much less damage, uh, so 50% less damage uh, would be nice, but as I made a mistake, 
I will just go with this. But that was just a demonstration. If I would play for real, I would not use this. But this one's not really hard at all. Uh, okay, so he's way down, and now we can try to destroy him for good. Just gonna wail on him. That was criticals, and then... Yeah, I also hope you're doing this right, because if you strike yourself, we did. Okay, we not did. We, of course, won, because uh, he is slightly competent. He does follow orders that we put out. And after everything, we get another chest. After every battle, you get one, so that's pretty cool. Uh, you get some new skills. Supercharge is uh, good, but it has pretty big cooldown. Fired up means that Koa is... Uh, doing pretty well then, and Shield Slam would be for Gramps. I will go for uh, Fired Up, because I do like my criticals in this kind of games. So here we are at the shop. Uh, Granny is selling those instead of giving them to us, even though she does live on our ship, so maybe we should charge rent in the future. Because she just give us this, right, for free if she lives uh, on our ship. But I took the missile thingy potions. I don't know how the potions can uh, shoot missiles, but here we are. That's the boss fight for this. I'm going to try out the potions because I did not use them. So let's see how they work. Boop is very, very scared because... Uh, he is a robot with feelings. So I have these vials. Jar of missiles should go there. And maybe poison. Yeah, that should do it. Okay, so fight. Now, let's try out the potion. Which, uh, for first turn, maybe not the best thing. But you know what? I think we'll win anyway. Um, bottle of aches. This, oh. Oh, wait, no. No way. I can just use those at will. Yeah, okay, so this one's over. Uh, this is the hardest fight of my life. Oh, wow. Okay, I know I'm limited by stacks and I probably shouldn't do this, but I know it's over after this battle, so I'm just gonna... I didn't know you can use them like this, though. I thought it's like one per turn, maybe, but... Yeah, easiest fight of my life was pretty good though, I, I do like the game uh, until now. So here we are uh, in the raid mode, this is another mode we have in the demo here. Uh, because I finished the prologue, we can't continue with campaign sadly, but uh, raid is basically you go uh, and you destroy more and more enemies until you fight the boss. So I'm fighting one Bob here. Mega Corruption Potion is what I got from Granny, who is uh, freeloading and charging us money for potions here. Uh, I'm gonna just try it out to see how it works. Of course, I could just, you know, go with my uh, free destroy everything potions here, but I'm gonna save them. I am quite far away from the boss and I don't have like a lot of coins right here, so that's why I'm going to save this. But let's shield Koa so he doesn't get scratched because then uh, mother of Koa would be very angry at Gramps. Of course, if he brings Koa back uh, severely injured, that wouldn't, uh, that wouldn't be good, right? Why is my son missing half of his leg, for example? So Gramps is a little bit irresponsible, but it is what it is. Let's shield up here. They do 10 damage. Let's see, if, if you do this, then he just does 5 damage. And, uh, you know, the shield wouldn't really be necessary here, because Boop has a relic which gives him shield already. The only weakling in my team is Koa, who is supposed to be the DPS, but... Um, I didn't get any good rolls on my skill, so it is what it is. So Koa will get his shield. And I'll try this out, even though I shouldn't try this out now, but... Let's see how much damage they take with just... Oh, jeez. That is... Pretty good, I would say. Although I should have used this a bit better, 
maybe in conjunction with the whack-a-mole which refreshes if you kill one enemy so i would have a refresh i could use it again but in any case i think i'm not taking any damage so it's not really important but the thoughts about this game so far it is good it is fun it's very fun to play i uh will review the whole game when it comes out but as of now it's a very very nice uh card roguelike i do like it it's not too complicated so anyone can just jump in um so yeah this was actually very nice i am going to end the video here so if you did like it there's a link in the description you can uh, click it it will take you to steam and you can uh wishlist the game it is pretty good so if you like this kind of games for now i do recommend it i will cover it in whole so if you're not sure maybe wait for that if you liked the video subscribe comment uh, call me uh, mindless if you uh, you know don't like it one dude did so that's it until next time goblin out bye